So corn is cheap and it's just you and you want nice ear corn. Well, you don't have to put it in a pot. You don't have to boil all your nutrition away. We're gonna learn how to cook this in the microwave. You're not going to take the husk or the silk off of it. We're just going to put it in the microwave. Once you put it in the microwave, we're gonna put it in there for three minutes. And then we'll begin to dress it up. Just plop it down on the bottom tray. That's more than sufficient. The maximum that you can put up in here is probably about three. We'll set the timer. Let's give it three minutes. Okay, now three minutes has passed. And this is hot. So you're gonna hold it by either end. This is one of the easiest ways to have fresh corn. And I don't understand why people take the shuck off of it before they come home. Because this keeps it moist, keeps the nutrients inside. The silk just pulls right on off. Throw that aside. And look at that, hot, steaming, delicious in its own shell. So I have very few particles of the silk, but it comes off completely. And now you're ready. Now we can do damage. I prefer to hold it here, but you can just twist it right on off and it comes off. Oh, this is hot and delicious on its own. It doesn't need any help. Just the way nature intended. But of course, we can't get away with doing a little bit of butter. And of course, I have my moringa butter. You can put your favorite topping on it. But I try to keep everything that I enjoy nutritious. So don't go, don't go away, butter. And this moringa butter is one of the best concoctions I have ever come up with. It just keeps my food healthy, nutritionally wise. Vitamin A, C, D's, calcium. And of course, we can't finish that off. A little bit of salt. Guys, here you have it. Three minutes from start to finish. Corn on the cob. Using your microwave. Mm, 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 mm. Isn't that pretty?